स्टूडेंट्स इन कॉस्ट अकाउंटिंग ओके फॉर बीबीए एंड बीकॉम स्टूडेंट्स देर इज ए कॉस्ट शीट ओके प्रिपरेशन ऑफ कॉस्ट शीट देर इज ए क्वेश्चन फॉर फोर्टीन मार्क्स See, Tata Engineering Company manufactured and sold 1,000 machines in 2016. And following are the particulars obtained: cost of materials, wages paid, factory expenses, salaries, rent, rates, insurance, selling expenses, general expenses, sales. The company plans to manufacture 1,200 machines in 2017. You are required to submit the statement showing price to earn a profit of 10% on selling price. The following additional information is given to you: price of material will rise by 20% on the previous year's price, wages will rise by 5%, manufacturing expenses will rise in proportion to the combined cost of materials and wages, selling expenses per unit will be remain unchanged, other expenses will remain unaffected by rise in output. Okay, so these are the information they have given. Now, from where we have to start? Say we have to start with the prepared cost sheet, cost information they were given for 2016 year. Okay, and they have manufactured 1,000 units. They have manufactured 1,000 units. It is given in the first paragraph itself, right? So what is given is first up is given cost of materials. So, what is the cost of materials used for manufacturing 1,000 units is 80,000 rupees. For one unit, it becomes 80 rupees. Got it? 80,000 divided by 1,000. Okay. Next is wages. What is the wages paid is 1 lakh 20,000 rupees for 1,000 units. For one unit, it becomes 120 rupees. So no other direct expenses is given. If you add these two, we get the prime cost. We get the prime cost. It is two lakh rupees per unit. It would be two hundred rupees, right, sir? For this, what is to be added? Factory overheads we have to add. What is factory overhead? Factory expenses. What are the factory expenses we have? See, is clearly given factory expenses is fifty uh, thousand rupees. Fifty thousand is for one thousand units. For one unit, it becomes fifty rupees. Next, uh, anything else is given related to the factory? Nothing else is given. So, if you add this, you get two lakh fifty thousand rupees, and it becomes two hundred and fifty rupees. This is what we call it as. factory cost what is this factory cost to this factory cost we have to add administration or office overheads so administration office overhead see salaries we pay in the office only salaries is 60000 for one unit it becomes 60 rupees right sir rent rates taxes Rent, rates, taxes, insurance, ten thousand rupees for one thousand. One unit it is ten rupees. Next is general expenses. See, usually general expenses is nothing but other expenses which are related to office, which comes to twenty thousand rupees, and you get twenty rupees per unit. Right, sir. Right or wrong? Yes. Add all these things. Three ten three four three forty three lakh forty thousand rupees and this becomes three forty rupees per unit, right? So this is, yeah, everything should be added. So all this thing. Yeah, here six two lakh fifty plus sixty three ten units. Units even this is also should be added. Everything should be added. There is no item that has to be minus here. Okay, this is called as cost of production. What is this? Cost of production, or we also call it as cost of goods sold. Both are same. In this question, both are same. To this, what is to be added? Selling expenses, or selling and distribution overhead. See, we have selling expenses. How much is given selling expenses? Thirty thousand rupees. 
See, 30,000 rupees you incurred for 1,000 units. For one unit, it becomes 30 rupees. Am I right? So, this is called as total cost. Got it, sir? So, now what is the total of this? 370,000 and 370 rupees per unit. Got it now? Understood or wrong? Yes. Now, let us see what is the amount to this total cost. What is to be added? General. Profit is to be added. Am I right? Profit is to be added. But is not given in the question. Does it given? No. See, what is the total sales made is given. What is the total sales made by him? Is 4 lakhs. See, if 4 lakhs is the sales and 3 lakhs 70 is your cost, then 30,000 rupees is your profit. Am I right? 4 lakh minus 3 lakh 70 is 30,000. So 30,000 profit you got for 1,000 unit. What is for 1 unit is 30 rupees. Now your total selling price per unit is 4 lakh, 400 and total cost is 4 lakh rupees. Got it? This is for 2017, I mean 16. But we have an estimated cost sheet. What is this? Estimated. estimated cost sheet. Sir, what is this estimated cost sheet? We are preparing for 2017. We are manufacturing 1200 machines. Okay. How many machines? 1200 machines we are manufacturing. Now, we have particulars. You should take the calculators and be ready with the answers okay otherwise it becomes difficult for me to complete in time or on time okay what it guys take your calculators and be ready now what is given in the adjustment let us see when you are manufacturing thousand units you incur different expenses in a different way now, in the next year, when it is in the next year, in the year 2017, you are manufacturing 1200 machines. See, 2016 to 17, prices are going to increase, decrease. That's why I'm going to the first adjustment. Modi, price of raw materials will rise by 20% on previous year price. On previous year price. See, previous year price material was 80 rupees per unit. Right or no? Here, here it is there. It is given here. I have calculated. Right, Dipesh. Look at here, board. Material, we have calculated 80,000. 80 rupees per unit. But now, from 80, it is increased by how much? 20%. So now, cost of materials. Okay. Cost of materials. 80 is uh, the cost in 2016. Now it is increased by how much? 20%. What is 20% on 80 rupees is 16 rupees. Now the cost of one unit of raw material in the year 2017 is how much? 96 rupees. You got it? Now 96 rupees is per unit for 1200. 96 into 1200. Jora held with you. 1,15,200. Correct. Uh? Next is wages. See what wages is given. Wages is we calculated 120 rupees. Because last year wages was 1,20,000. Right sir? Right or no? Sir. Now it is increased by 5%. So last year wages was 120 rupees. Now it is increased by 5 percent. On 120,000, 5 percent is how much? 6 rupees. Correct? Huh? 120 into 5 percent is 6 rupees. Correct? Huh? Now what is the total wages per unit income? 126 rupees. One twenty into five percent. Five percent correct I the bleed. Now go to the kerala, okay? Go till there. Go to the mark. 
Okay, you got it now. Yeah. Now 120 is per unit. What is for 1200 units? Other money. 126 into 1200. 1 lakh 200. Now this is your prime cost. Right, sir? Correct, I yes, Correct. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Total. 2,66,400 This is 222 rupees Per unit To this what is to be added? Factory overheads Correct? Huh? See factory overheads gain other Adjustment in the unknown. See is evenly given Manufacturing expenses is nothing but what? Factory expenses Manufacturing expenses will rise In proportion to the Combined cost of material and wages Combined cost of materials and wages. What is the combined cost of material and wages? Look at here, 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 here it is there. Material and wages. What was the last year's material and wages? 2 lakhs. Correct? Uh? See, uh, manufacturing expenses, very simple like logic, you know. See, 2 lakhs was the materials incurred and wages incurred in the last year. This was for how many units? 1000 units. Correct sir? Yes or no? 1000 units. Now how many units you are manufacturing? 1000 units you are manufacturing. Tell me what is the cost? Correct. Uh, 2 lakh 40 divided by 1200 and how much you get? 200, 200 rupees you get. 200 and 50 rupees. 2 lakh 40. Yeah, 200 rupees. How oh, this? Manufacturing expenses will rise in proportion to the combined cost of materials and wages. Wait a minute. Uh, manufacturing expenses will rise in proportion to the combined cost of materials and wages. Okay, like this we have to do it. I'm sorry. See, 50,000 was the expenses, am I right? Last year, what was the manufacturing or factory expenses? 50,000. This was incurred when there was a 2 lakh rupees or 1,000 units. What is for 1,200 units? This is correct answer. Sir, I didn't understand. You didn't understand. See, what was the last year's? What was the last year's? Factory, factory is nothing but a manufacturing. Factory is nothing but where do you manufacture? In factory. factory. So factory expenses is 50,000. What have you written? Factory cost also. Factory expenses. Factory cost is this. Factory expenses is this. Okay. Now last year factory expenses was 50,000 for 1,000 units. What is for 1,200 units? 60,000. Am I right? Now, 60,000 is for 1,200 units. What is for per unit is 50 rupees only. It would be 50,000 only. 50 rupees only. Right? Now, check the total. 3 lakh 22,000, And this is 272 rupees. This is what we call it as factory cost. Right sir? Right or no? See, one more point is given. Other expenses will remain unaffected by rise in output. Other expenses means what? Administration expenses. Am I right? Sir, so the selling expenses for the moment. That, that comes after the administration. We should take after factory, what we should take? Of administration. See, administration overheads see try to understand the 
sentences then only you can able to solve what is given other expenses will remain unaffected by rise in output that means the output is 1000 units here it is 1200 if you manufacture 1000 units or 1200 units the other expenses will not change will not affect remain unaffected means will not change that means what is the administration and office expenses in total of these three no 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 only these three only these three only no how much it is 90,000 see even that also you are telling like incorrectly correct it is 90,000 60 70 90 correct now 90,000 is remain unaffected if you produce 1000 1000 units also 1200 units it remains same now 90,000 divided by 1200 units how much you will get 75 rupees now check the totals 4 lakh 16000 400 uh, 7 4 and 347 rupees this is called cost of production or also called as cost of goods sold for this what is to be added selling expenses we have to add see now we have to read the adjustment for selling expenses selling expenses per unit will remain unchanged what is the selling expenses per unit 30 rupees 30 rupees this will remain unchanged now 30 into 1200 is 36000 rupees right this is called as total cost now this will become 4,52,400 and 377 rupees to this what is to be added by profit to be added this is a balancing figure then what is the next sales what is given for profit see if you look at the the <coughs> paragraph 1 the company plans to manufacture 1200 machines in 2017 you are required to submit the statement showing price to earn a profit of 10% on selling price see guys 10% on selling price means on not on cost what is given on selling price that means if your sales is 100 rupees your profit is how much 10 rupees then what is your total cost 90 rupees am i right yes or no you got no rupai one goes to the model there nimm got to rupai lava it there you know nimm ge asal is with the rute 90 rupees with the rute and then i'll end up through rocket science with the other after my goal kasa give the other yes i don't understand that which one three thousand three lakh sixty thousand and thirty units after that Total cost Check the total adding. That's all. After that, uh, we call it as a total cost. Okay, that we don't add after that. That's what now we have to find out. Okay. See, we have to add the profit. Kotila profit kotila. Oh, the profit bandila the sales go thang thang thang. Tomma rupee in manufacturing cost side is total cost side is. Yes rupee matiya ning kotila. Yawa go thang go thang. Yes rupee profit beko add mana do thang go thang go thang. That is Kotila question only. But what is the answer? If sales is 100 rupees, that is the profit of 100 rupees. That is the profit of 100 rupees. That is the profit of 90 rupees. Your cost. Correct? It is your cost. It is your expenses. Now, we know what is the cost. 4,52,400. The cost is equal to how much? 90. Am I right? What is for 10 rupees of profit? Tell yes for the answer. 4,52,400 Right? Yeah, here Because 10% means 10 by 100 10 by 100 Means 100 rupees is your profit I mean sales 10 rupees is a profit Understood? Yes, sir 50,000 50,000 2 rupees 266 Okay, now let us add this. 
फाइव लैक टू थाउजेंड सिक्स सिक्सटी सिक्स ठीक है फिफ्टी थाउजेंड टू सिक्सटी सिक्स डिवाइडेड बाई वन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी वन रुपीज एटी फोर्टी वन फिफ्टी थाउजेंड टू सिक्सटी सिक्स डिवाइडेड बाई वन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी वन फोर्टी वन एक्सैक्टली फोर्टी वन डॉट एट ट्रिपल एट ओके ट्रिपल एट ओके सो टोटली फॉर हाउ मच फोर हंड्रेड एटीन रुपीज एटी एट पैसे फोर हंड्रेड एटी वन रुपीज एटी एट पैसे भी आसान गॉड इज सर्स दिस इज फॉर फोर्टीन मार्क्स सी डूइंग दिस कॉस्ट शीट इज वेरी सिंपल यू शुड नो दिस फ्लो ओके यू शुड नो दिस फ्लो वंस इफ यू नो दिस फ्लो राइट द सेम कॉन्सेप्ट हियर ओके सेम कॉन्सेप्ट बट रीड द एडजस्टमेंट इफ मेटीरियल इज इंक्रीज Earlier price was eighty rupees, increased by twenty percent. Wages earlier price was one twenty, increased by five percent, six one twenty six. Multiply thousand two hundred. You understood. Next is factory expenses. What is given? Proportionately increase. Proportionately increase. See, factory expenses was fifty thousand. It is proportionately increased towards material and wages. See, material and wages was two lakhs in the last one for one thousand units, fifty thousand. What is for one thousand two hundred units? See, if you want to try it out in other way also, we can do it. If you want in other way also, we can do it. How it is other way is very simple. Fifty uh, rupees is for one thousand units. What is for one thousand two hundred units? Because if you calculate. We have calculated, uh, yeah, total cost. Here we are calculating with a what per unit. Per unit. You will get the same. You will get the same. You will get the sixty thousand rupees only. Are they that? I tell you what. Okay. We got only total cost. We can do them. Yeah, total cost is sixty. Fifty thousand though. Ingo bani fifty thousand. No, is that you? Jappa, when there is a two lakh rupees, correct? Ah, ni daagal lagi. Tera work daagal lag. Ah, percentages par the hele. Percent into hundred money. One four twenty five percent. Correct? Ah, so I'll get fifty thousand mil hai. Twenty five percent under hai. Ipar thay thay nuri par thay. अडजस्ट आगे करेक्ट आगे क्लियर ओके बर्को फोटो